Hey y'all, hey. Hey y'all, hey. Hey y'all, hey. So, I wasn't going to make a video today. I have some other videos that I already made that I need to upload and I haven't uploaded yet. I was going to make a video today. Um, but literally I was just sitting here in my car and I was like, this is exactly why things happen the way they do. Um, and this is a major test for me. Because literally, um, I was already warned about some things that were going to happen here recently. Um, and they started to manifest today. So, God takes us through different things. Sometimes he'll allow us to continuously go through something until we pass the test. Okay? Um, he will continuously put us in situations he will continuously allow us to encounter the same situation with a different, um, in a different atmosphere, in a different location, with a different person, in a different scenario, but the same type of experience so that we can overcome and learn the lesson. Um, I literally had an experience today where I know the intention of it, and I've been saying this over and over again, that the enemy and the darkness is after our hearts. The darkness wants us to become bitter. It wants us to become angry. It wants us to become hard. It wants our hearts to draw cold so that we do not love, so that we do not forgive, so that we do not continue on so that we do not fight so that we do not even open our mouths i'm making this video um because this is this is a sign of warfare to the enemy this is also a sign of victory for me to say that no matter what life throws at me i i said this to this morning in conversation i said god knows just like job was tested god knows the hearts of men he knows what we can take he knows what we can bear he knows it so he will allow situations to happen in our lives because he knows that we can handle it you know there there are some times where people will have experiences i'm sorry and i don't like the way this darkness little thing is on my face making my face look y'all see that making my face look dark I ain't dark y'all um but situations will happen to where it will it will be so or seem so bad to where it will want um a normal person or maybe someone else would curse God and die you know like like in the story of Job when his wife even said curse God and die when his friends even said man why do you keep going on and job had to literally turn around and pray for his friends he had to literally tell his wife mm -mm. he lost everything he lost his he lost every single thing he had and the moment he lost it all it was the table being prepared before him in the presence of his enemies god restored him twice as much so i just wanted to get on here and say you guys like i've been through something just a couple minutes ago that literally i should be in distress i should be crying i should be asking god why i should be or not even i should be but maybe someone else maybe going through a circumstance where you know something has happened um to you or something has happened in your life but i wanted to come on here and encourage you that it's not happening to you it's happening for you and it's happening in you god is trying to perfect those things that concern you he's trying to produce from circumstances spiritual maturity so that he knows that you're ready for this season to say god no matter what it looks like i'm still going to obey you i'm still going to do what you tell me to do i'm still going to pray i'm still going to read my word i'm not going to fall back into the lust of the flesh the lust of the eye and the pride of life y'all i'm telling you this situation made me want to go pick up a black amount made me want to go pick do something do something to relieve myself but you want to know what i did i went to the dollar tree 
and I went and had some retail therapy at the Dollar Tree, okay? Because that's God has also been telling us to be good stewards over what he has. He's, he little becomes much when we place it in the master's hands. He wants us to steward what he's given us very well so that he can trust us with more. God in this season is testing us so that he knows what he can trust us with. And I just want to be available to know and, and to let God know that he can trust me with his very best. He can trust me with anything that he has in store for me. And um, yes, I just hopped on here to tell y'all no matter what it looks like, no matter what you face, no matter what the circumstance is, no matter what you see, no matter what has come, no matter what has gone, no matter what you may feel in your mortal body, in these emotions, trust God, trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not to your own understanding, but in all of your ways, acknowledge him and he will direct your path. Wait, I say on the Lord, and he will strengthen thy heart, okay? I love y'all so much. God loves you better, best, and the absolute most. There's nothing you can do about it, even if you try. I'm going to probably re-record the videos that I recorded before and post them a little bit later. Um, and it kind of shed some light on my experience today. Um, I love y'all so much. God loves you better, best, and the absolute most. Don't you dare forget it. Mm-hmm.